Hey everyone, welcome back to a new Wizard101 video. Today we're gonna be looking at the new Gauntlet bundle that just came out, and I didn't think I would be able to make this video anytime soon, but luckily I was able to get the bundle from someone else who had it at their Walmart, because I checked my Walmart yesterday and they didn't have it, so that's the only way I could get it. But Blue and I did the Gauntlet that you saw earlier today, and we were able to do that just because we knew someone that had it. Ben had that gauntlet, which I think he also got from the same person. So not too many people can get their hands on this gauntlet yet because it just depends where you live. It depends if your store has it or not. My Walmart doesn't, so maybe yours does. But this is the new Fantastic Voyage gauntlet, and we'll be looking through everything today. So let's take a look. Uh, Scepter of Tribute. I might as well just redeem this because I'm going to keep like accidentally clicking on it. <laughs> but thanks, Myson, for the Scepter of Tribute. So here we go. Starting things off, we have this Shark Ski Runner. This mount, it's 50%, so keep that in mind. But it's like a mechanical shark, so that's going to be a cool one to look at. So let's redeem that. There we go. Here is the actual gauntlet itself. We're going to have to make room for it, because this is where I put all my gauntlets in the Darkmoor house. So we'll make room for it somewhere. But that's what it looks like. You probably saw it in our other video. And then we got the whip. And I kind of want to redeem the pet right away. Peppy Porpoise, the new, uh, I'm guessing, life pet. A lot of life pets recently, but that has to load in a little bit. It's a dolphin. There you go. It's a cute dolphin. So we'll redeem that. Lady Lily. Okay. And then uh, we got the, uh, the wand and the new gear. So let's go ahead and redeem the gear first. And let's just go through all the tiers of it. So here's the lowest level, basically any level. And then we'll continue through that just to kind of give you guys an idea of all the levels. It gives double cleanse, dragon lance, double steel ward. Wow, interesting. And then all the way to 120. So here's 120. So it gives that dragon lance plus 35% and plus 10% pierce. Huh, self only. That's a cool one. Double steel ward. Three pips, and Dragonlance, by the way, is two pips in its balance. So if you're not balanced, that could be, I don't know, it's not something that you would really use. All these are no PvP as well. And then we also have uh, zero pip, double cleanse. That double cleanse could be really good, but it's no PvP. But, I don't know, I really like that one. Double cleanse. Hmm. But it's only on this, you know, piece of gear. So, we'll be trying those out. Maybe in a different video, I'll be trying out all of these. Maybe the wand even gives something cool. But we're going to redeem that for 120. Let's do it. I didn't even see what it looks like yet. But let's go ahead and redeem the wand as well. So the eel whip. Look at this. I feel like this is going to have really cool casting animation. I really want to see it. But here's the eel whip for all levels. And then it's going to progressively get better. Level 10, it's, it gives the, the pip. Wow. I'm just like thinking of my death wizard right now in the walkthrough. That could be good for him, but we're not going to do that because I would like outgrow the the wand eventually so then you start getting the power pip a little more damage get some crit in there as we go up and then we got the may cast so level 120 you're gonna get may cast wild bolt and may cast healing current i don't know if it does it both at the same time if it chooses one that's something that we'll have to test in the video where i just go over all the new cards i mean these aren't new cards but it's a new may cast on the wand so We'll be doing that. But it gives a lot of that pip conversion, 12% damage, and a little bit of crit and pierce. So let's redeem that for 120. So there you go. That's everything. Let's go ahead and dismount. Let's put on the gear first. So Abyssal Warriors set, basically. Put on all these. And then the wand, which I'm most excited for. There we go. There's the wand. <laughs> I look like I'm straight out of, like, a sea monster movie. I am the sea monster. Wow. There you go. It's like a ninja. I feel like I'm a ninja, like, sea monster. Then we got the whip. Got my whip. <laughs> Let's put on the the pet hasn't hatched yet. Let's put on the the new mount. Well, we can't look at the at the wand if we put on the mount. But yeah, there's the wand. It's an eel. I mean, you can see the eel's like head kind of up there. There it is. So here's the mount. What was it called? The Shark Ski Runner? Yep. Lock in that. This thing's 50% too. So, and it's pretty big. Look at this thing. I really want to turn up the sound so we can hear like the 
sound effects of it. Does it have any sound effects? Do I hear it? Yeah, it kind of creaks. And it shoots up water. Yeah, cause like a jet ski, right? Huh. I can hear it creaking. Like a jet ski. A shark jet ski. It like creaks like a boat would. I mean, it is like a jet ski, right? So, your own shark, mechanical shark jet ski, I guess would be the proper name for it, right? It's cool. Okay, let's see what the jump looks like. You kind of hear that? Yeah. And it's going to shoot water right into the camera. <laughs> that's kind of weird. I don't like, I don't know. That's weird. Like, look, it goes straight into the camera. It doesn't even look like it. it does that at all times too. If you're just like going straight, it's gonna like shoot it right at you. That's interesting. Like if you're going on a, a flat surface, right in your face. <laughs> so the only thing left to check what is the what does the, the backup look like? It looks like on the side. Hold up, we're, we're back into the Grand Tourney Gauntlet. Wait, does he only go that way? That's weird. This is so weird. This is the weirdest backup I've, I've ever seen. He's like sideways. What the? I don't know. You like back up to the side. Huh. Like this is the regular backup. You're going completely sideways. <laughs> yeah. Can you turn the other way? Nope, it's only this way. Okay, interesting. That's the backup. Uh, only thing left to check now would be the idol as I get stuck by the rock. Okay. So let's check the idol. Just, you know, hold still while the shark contemplates doing something cool. Hopefully it's cool. You know, I used to really like the shark mount, the hammerhead shark mount in Pirate. So that's kind of what this reminds me of. Just like a, you know, updated edition of that uh, shark mount. I mean, his mechanical 50% speed older brother. Is he going to do anything for the idol? Come on. Come on, shark. Look at his, like, movement when you're not moving. It like, goes in a circle. It's not up and down. It's, like, in a circular motion. He's not going to do anything for us? As soon as I go and look at the pet, he's going to do it. I hope he doesn't, but maybe he will. But here's the pet. I don't know what the, his name was. Oh, yeah, Lady Lily. Of course. How could I forget Lady Lily? I'll put on the pet. I'm not going to be able to see it yet. I really want this thing to do something. If I don't do it now, I'll forget to do it. Wait, what was that? I don't even know what that was. Why do you like put his hand up? I'd have to see that one again. Was he like floating up in the air and maybe it was like he was riding on top of waves or something. That was interesting. I want to see that again, but of course it's going to take forever. I can never get this to, to go. Huh, it's all creaky, the the big creaky mechanical shark. So that's the idol. Hmm. So pretty unique mount. I really like it. I think it's one of the best pieces in this uh, bundle. So pretty cool mount. Let's go ahead and look at the pet as well as the gauntlet itself. So here's a little cute dolphin. Yes. I love that I can show jumping animations of the new pets now. So cute. Does it make sound though? I don't think you can hear it yet, but... When we do the pet showcase, it'll probably make some sound. Because I just feel like it should be making sound right now, like a dolphin. Like, dolphins are pretty loud, I feel like. But, little baby dolphin. Super cute pet. <gasps> what the? Wait, does he just do that? I never even realized that. Probably because I was on the mouth the whole time. Or he just never did it. So he like flips the the whip. That's cool. <laughs> okay. So the pet we will be doing pet showcase on the new uh Peppy Porpoise. I'm gonna have to, you know, nail that name so I don't mess it up at any point during the, the actual pet showcase, because it could be difficult to say. Peppy Porpoise. But here's some of his talents that we'll look at in that video. A few epics there, three of them. So another life pet. Oh, that's what it looks like when it like yeah, kind of an idol for that. It's cute. 
Let's take a look at the Fantastic Voyage Expedition, which is going to be difficult to find a place for this because I'm running out of space. Okay, I mean, this, this doesn't really look that good, but okay, it doesn't even fit there. <laughs> it doesn't even fit. We have no room. I wish I could move these trees. I'm trying to fit it right here. Okay. I mean, it doesn't look the best there. Can I, if I turn it, does it look? That doesn't look any better. <laughs> I mean, is that going to look good? Like, what does that look like? It looks kind of weird like that, but I mean, does this look good or does the other way look good? This would be the other option. I mean, that looks okay, right? This thing's kind of just like weirdly sh like shaped. You can go up here too. Ring the bell. Interactable. Did not mean to you know, go on the sigil, but. Interactable gauntlet. That's nice. Can I do it again? We're taking off. We're going on our fantastic voyage, which goes to a pretty unique area. So go check out the other video if you haven't. I had to kind of squeeze everything else together here. Does this look good if I, maybe if I put this a little bit like that. See, these gauntlets are easy to move, but this one, like, I don't know what it is about it, but it just doesn't line up as well as the other ones do. Maybe if I do that. That's about the best we're going to get. So now we have a total of six gauntlets in the game. It's a lot. The original, and then some of the newer ones here, and then, of course the fantastic voyage expedition now you can interact with your gauntlet so it's nice but i think that's about gonna do it for this video so does this one make noise when you're not even over there can you like hear it maybe not i mean i can hear the water from this yeah so we added another gauntlet to our gauntlet house here. I mean, it's not like the whole house is gauntlets, but just like this little side. Looks pretty good. So, that's going to do it. Fantastic Voyage Gauntlet bundle, if you will. Uh, go check out the actual gauntlet if you want to watch Blue and I do the 120 level for the gauntlet. So, pretty nice. But, we will be doing a few other videos. Uh, I know people probably want to see the uh, casting animation for this. And I'm just going to throw that all into another video where I look at the May cast. I look at... Uh, double cleanse we'll see what a double cleanse is like and uh even the double steel ward maybe we'll try to pull that off so that's gonna do it hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did leave a like on it uh, for the new bundle and hopefully it's available soon if you want to you know try to get your hands on it too but thanks for watching and i'll see you all next time before we end things off here's just a sneak peek of what the casting animation looks like because i'm excited to see it too so here we go let me turn on my sound effects a little bit here we go I love it. I love it. Okay. There you go. Sneak peek. Stay tuned for that video soon. Thanks for watching. Like I said, see you guys next time.